Hey everybody, this is Mike here from True Survival. Today we're going to do a product review and field test on the SOL Origin Survival Kit. Also, if you stay tuned through the entire video, at the end I'm going to talk about how you can win one of these for free, brand new, shipped directly to your house. So stay tuned for that. So we're going to start out going over all the cool features this SOL has. Um, it is named as an all-in-one survival kit, so let's hope it has all, all of that included. First thing, pop the top, you have a signal mirror. Now a signal mirror is great, pretty self-explanatory. If you need a signal, you can signal. It has instructions on how to use a signal mirror. It has the sighting tool on the back, okay? So that's the first thing, awesome feature. Now the next thing, if you pop this open, it comes with instructions. And also, you can see right there, you have 62 life-saving tools and techniques by Buck Tilton. And I've actually gone through them and there's some really good ones. We'll set that aside. Uh, inside the kit, if you look inside, it includes a sewing kit with three safety pins. You have a needle, you have fishing line, you have some waders and some fishing hooks. Okay, so that's their fishing kit they include. You have... 10 feet of wire. Uh, some of the other things, you have 10 feet of nylon braided rope. That could come in really handy. Um, let's see, you have some little fire starting spark buds, I call them. There's plenty of different names for them, but basically they help you start a fire. So that's what those are. There's four of those. And then you have a one foot by one foot square piece of aluminum foil. So that's everything that's on the inside. I'm going to go ahead and put it back in. I'll talk to you about what else is on the outside of the kit, what else it includes. Now this kit is to be claimed to be waterproof and float, so we're going to we're going to test that and make sure everything works properly. So just get everything back in. All right. We're going to go ahead and close it up. Now, when you're closing it up, it is waterproof, but if you there's a rubber seal around the outside. Now, if you get a piece of plastic, one of the bags, pinch in that seal, you're going to break your waterproof seal. So you need to make sure everything's clear, and then as you close it, press it, lock it down. Okay, so that's everything on the inside. Now we're going to talk about what else it has. If you look on the back, you got a variety of options. Now there's a cool locking mechanism here. You pull this up, this slides out. Now with this, you have a light, which is actually a really bright light for how small it is. You have an emergency whistle, and then you also have a knife. So you got a little, little pocket knife, and I like the light feature because you can actually turn on the light and then use your knife and you can see where you're cutting and stuff. So that's good. Stainless steel blade, so that's one piece. We'll go ahead and slide that back in. It locks in, which is good. Um, the compass. Now you can use the compass from, you know, the kit, or you can pop it off and use it like that. And it's a liquid-filled compass, um, and it holds pretty, pretty true compared to some of my other high-quality compasses. It's right on, which is awesome. You, you want to make sure your compass works. And then my favorite feature, a little. Uh, sparker there so great for a fire starter lasts a long time um, yeah and so you can use that to start your fire but pretty much that's all of it on the external you got a lot of key features you have your compass for your navigation you have your signal you have your light you have you have your uh, yeah your whistle for communication you have your fire fishing line you really have an all-in-one kit now my curiosity is, one, does it float, because they say it floats. Uh, one other feature before we float, it comes the lanyard, wrist lanyard, that's a good feature. So we're gonna, I'm gonna set it in here, see if it floats, and then I'm gonna submerge it and hold it down there, look for bubbles, and see how long I can hold it under, and then we'll pull it out and see if there's any water in it. So first test, float test. It looks like it seems to float pretty well, I'll try to, let me get the camera, see if I can get a little closer. Today's the first day I'm trying to use this GoPro, so you can see it floats. Let's go ahead and submerge it. Now there's not a lot of 
Not a lot of bubbles coming out, which is a good thing because if bubbles were coming out, that would mean water's getting in. So we'll turn it over, give it some rotations. If any water's gonna get in, we'll shake it. It's gonna get in, see if it floats. All right, floats back up. I'll get my camera reset. All righty, so it shows its floats. Let's take it off, take it out, shake it off. Now you're gonna have water near part, you're gonna have a little bit of water. That's not that big of a deal. My worry is the internals. Shake it, my hands are wet. So. All right, I'm gonna pop it open. Let's look on the inside. Ah, nice and dry. Everything's dry. You got a little bit on the rim, but that's, that's paper in there and the paper's not wet, so that means it's dry. And it held a good seal. So that's awesome. Um, you don't have to worry about in your gear getting wet. Let's try out this uh, sparking thing here, this fire starter after it got real wet. Still got a spark. So that's a good feature too. But pretty much that's a quick overview and field test of this product. Um, remember to like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, uh, follow us on Instagram. We're actually gonna be giving one of these away. So starting today, today is June 29th, it's Sunday. I'm gonna upload this video. We're gonna upload on Instagram how to win this. Basically, you're gonna need to like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Go to our Instagram, follow us on Instagram, and then uh, tag as many friends that are survivalist outdoor friends in, in our Instagram. And we're going to keep this going until we get up to 300 followers on Instagram. Once we hit that 300 follower mark, we're going to give this away. So thanks for uh, joining me today. If you have any questions about this product, let me know. We also sell it on our website at truesurvival.com. I'm going to put the link right in the video right up here on top. You can click on that link, it'll take you right to the product on our website where you can purchase it from there. But thanks for joining me. Have a great day.